Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Wendy and Kimono. This is Kimono. Um, Tuesday, I think it was, I got uh, my package in and I showed on Instagram that I actually got a few Tatoshi. Now, I've been in the process of um, changing up my Tatoshi because the uh, closet that I have, the wardrobe, it's only 75 centimeters wide and the usual Tatoshi, like the bigger ones, they're too wide, so the ends stick up. I'll go in um, the wardrobe in a second. So I got these instead. I've had several, like this one has my green uh, Iromuji in it. These are just two empty ones. So I got these instead. These are 64 centimeters wide. They're a pack of 10. They're all neatly stacked into one another so I'll be filling these up with you guys oh, there we go <laughs> it's really bright in here so this kind of yeah not a really uh, get ready with me but um, change up my Tatoshi with me <laughs> I don't know how you want to call this but I've I just had this idea and I wanted to do it and I hope you uh, that you guys like it I keep my fingers crossed that the construction workers will keep quiet. I um, am filming this at um, you know, half past um, noon, so I guess they are on break. So it's all nice and quiet for now, but I don't think it will last too long. So let's get into the wardrobe. I will show you guys. So, so this is basically why I keep my complete kimono collection. So as you can see, these are the, the Tatoshi that I want them, want them in. But if I go up, like these, the, um, these are the ones that are too wide. But I can't up, can't open up my um, doors more somehow. Okay. Oh, there, there you go. There you can see it. So I'll be changing up hopefully these. And these, I only really have 10, so I'll see how far I'll be able to get. But yeah. And then I have a couple more that I've made Hikizuri that I need to change at some point as well. I also want to get more of uh, these. There's actually special Tatoshi for Obi. I got a couple of Nagoya will be in there, so they can be folded completely flat instead of how I have it. And if yeah, hopefully I can show you guys. Yeah, even <laughs> I even need to use a ladder despite being so tall. So they all stacked nice and neat and, and flat, so I can stack more and. I don't know, expand my collection even more, I guess. <laughs> but yeah, I haven't been able to find these on the internet much, so I guess I'll have to ask Ichiroi again if they know where I can get these. No, no they're like five, 50 centimeters or something. They're even a size smaller than the, the other ones that I just bought. The ones that I bought are for um, Kimura and Obi, at least that's how they're advertised. But these ones are uh, for Obi only, specifically Nagoya, like, oh, I think. My Fukuro haven't, been, I haven't been able to fit inside of these, so I guess they're for Nagoya oh, only. Let's put this one back. Let's close my wardrobe up. And then I will grab these ones.
I just put all the kimono that I want to transfer to the new Tatoshi. So I got out of my wardrobe and put them here. No worries, floor's clean, vacuumed and scrubbed so they won't get dirty. So I just got a loose one here. So you can see the difference quite clearly. And these ones fit much, much better inside my wardrobe. Because these ones, um, they're ripped. They're old. I got them for free at an uh, antique shop in Amsterdam who generally just throws them away. Also, they're stained so much. The ripped one. Oh, yeah. Here you go. So. I'm not sure what I will be doing with the ones that are ripped. I'll likely just toss them. But yeah. Let's get into the transferring process. So that's about halfway, well, at least the first uh, stack of kimono. These are all the men's kimono. Still got a couple left. One, two, three, four, five. Not sure if that's enough for all of these. One, two, three, four, five. How about that? Exactly enough. <laughs> I think it's my lucky day day today. So. Something that I kind of want to eat. so there are like two or more different kinds of tatashi. This one, this one has like an like a lining of some sort, like a really see-through and all, but it's just another layer. So it's really cool. So I guess protect your kimono even more. I don't know. <laughs> like I said, I've, I got these for free because I put them good, to good use like a couple of years ago. So oh, going backwards a little bit. So you can you can see the difference between the, the outer layer and the inner layer. So yeah. It's really cool. So you can see even all the it's just these ones even got broken off. 
so they are really really past the the due date so to speak they're old and really needs to be tossed luckily they are made of paper so they're really they're excellent for recycling and recycling and all so i'll definitely put them in the recycling bin the ones that i won't will not use it's up with the tears and all so yeah let's get to the last uh, stack of tatashi like oh i got the uh, okay i can actually see my common mostly um the spring ones transferring into the new ones finished transferring all the kimono into the near to touch and I guess it must have been six instead of five because I have one left so I'll sure to put that into good use so I guess I will be just looking through the uh, couple of them and see if I can still um, put them to use or if I just will throw them all away I don't think it will be worth to ship strip them to someone even for you of charge because they're really bad at like I got this one with my uh, rainbow fruit so that's been 2014 I'll be putting these back into the wardrobe and I will show you what it looks like so this is what it looks like after so right on top there's all the men's kimono that I have that I just transferred and this is the sack of common. Now, as you can see I still have a couple more left. These are the ones I'll be using in the upcoming season so they're easy to grab for me. And these ones definitely need a Totoshi too. I don't know. Yeah, those are Yukata and those are my summer kimono. Well, common at least. I won't be using those anytime soon as I'm not planning to go to the southern hemisphere. So these ones, well, this isn't just still a project waiting to be finished. This one still needs a Tatashi and then a couple that one half them, like you can see the stripes, uh, Hikizuri, the one rabbit under, under that one, that is holding my cream one with the blue um, plants that one is already in a proper like, tatoshi that fits so I don't need to buy one for that uh, but I still have my patchwork kiki underneath 
that one does need a new Tatashi. So it looks much better now, much more streamlined. And these aren't that expensive either. I think um, the wider ones are like 13 uh, US dollars for a pack of 10. And these ones are 11. So they're pretty good deal. This is the second set of 10 that I bought. So I'm definitely planning on getting another one for the ones that still need one, like these and these, these and a couple of my hiki. Yep, I'm really liking the... So with that, I transferred my, my Totoshi, I still need to get rid of them. Uh, and I'm really happy because the construction workers, they started again. Like about five minutes ago and I got uh, done in the nick of time. I hope you weren't able to hear them through my talkie. They're not too loud anymore but they're still doing construction work. I can still hear it. Sometimes they're knocking down things that I wonder whether it's on the other cross uh, on the other side of the building or right underneath where I live. But yeah, I hope you like this kind of video. It's my first time ever, so um, if you like it, let me know. Give me a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you want to see more, and I will see you next time. Bye, everyone.